everyone. Today's unboxing video is a state spotlight and the state that we are spotlighting today is the state of Colorado. And the company that I am spotlighting from Colorado is Lunazul Gallery, which is located in Colorado Springs, Colorado. Now, I have been mostly spotlighting companies that <clears throat> make their products in the US. This is not the case with Luna Zool Gallery. They curate items from around the world. Um, they uh, specialize with Mexican folk arts, native arts, and unique items in the world. They collaborate with artisans to design and bring forth unique items that are not typically seen in galleries in the U.S. So, um, <clears throat> but they themselves are located in Colorado, so. I ordered three products, I believe. Yes, three products from them. The products were $40. The shipping was free. I paid for tax, $2.80. So the total for this order was $42.80. And it took three days to get to me, which is actually really, really good. So let's see what we got. Oh, this is one of those boxes I should have I should have done something before I started the video I think <laughs> I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to open it there we go come on now okay that one I can cut all right after all of that, 10 hours later. Okay, let me pull out my shipping slip. So here I'll show you their card. I'll put a link down below to their website so you can check them out. And also to my website, which will give you a more formal review and pictures. Okay. I did receive something else in there, which I'll show you when I actually get to the product. Okay, so I got padding, and then here's a product, here's a product, here's a product. Okay, so let me move my box. Okay. So there's the three items that I got. So let's see what the first item is. The first item, I like that they're packaged in a, like a, a foam padding. Okay, so the first item that I have is a wooden spoon, a uh, wooden spatula. So this is a hand carved wood spatula made from, now I'm going to mispronounce this, I'm sure but made from guamuchil wood. Guamuchil wood. I was like, that's cool. I didn't realize it was gonna be so long. They have measurements, I didn't bother to measure. That's, that's pretty long. But I like, the, I like the way the wood is. Very nice. Okay. And then, uh, let me go with this one. This one. Oh, yep, this is the copper. So this is a hand hammered copper. I'm sorry, not hand hammered. This is the hammered, which could be hand hammered, but that's not what the description said for it. Hammered copper half ounce or one tablespoon coffee scoop measuring spoon seven and a half inches look at that that's so pretty don't you think you can kind of see the designing you can see where it's been hammered oh i like that and also this is what i was going to say was they also gave me copper care instructions 
Um, they had a lot of neat copper items, but I had to stick within my budget, so I had to get small. Um, but they're worth checking out for some of their larger items. And they had, uh, and I can, can I say, they had some art, um, artwork, uh, sculptures and wall hangings and stuff that were really cool. Just outside of my particular budget currently, but I might have to go back and check them out. Okay, and then the last item I have, this is the hand hammered. <laughs> this is a copper pen. A uh, hand hammered copper ink pen with a mini water pitcher. Look at that. Let me see if I can get it close enough. Mini water pitcher adornment. Oh, that probably didn't work. Didn't help at all, did it? Let me put my paper behind it. See? Isn't that so cool? Uh, it is hand hammered. I don't know how copper is is um, worked with. I have been watching uh, my family and I've been watching the great pottery throwdown and it is fascinating to me how they work with the clays. So this this would be really cool. So I'm going to actually take my paper and write on it. Hello. Yep, works just fine. Okay. So that's everything that I got in my state spotlight box for Colorado from Lunazul Gallery. If you like this video, please take a moment to hit the like button down below. And also, if you subscribe to my channel, that would make my day. If you hit the notification bell, it'll let you know when I'm posting these unboxings. And as always, I really appreciate your comments. Um, what do you think about what I got here. Have you ever purchased from this gallery before? Did you know anything about them? Have I introduced you to somebody new? <laughs> or just say hi. Um, that's it for today's video. Thanks so much for stopping by and watching. You guys are awesome. Have a great day.